Well, you might remember just a few weeks ago, a local funeral home was looking for the family of a 99 year old woman who had died. Catherine Shirley, a woman who'd battled enough adversity for two lifetimes. Fox 4 story on the search for her family reached her half sister in California, who was able to be in Kansas City today for Shirley's farewell. Fox 4's Malik Jackson live from Marcom Harvey Funeral Home where the service took place in Malik. We hear the color of the day was pink. It indeed was Catherine Shirley's favorite color and what a tribute we saw to her life today. Just mere weeks ago, the closest thing to family she had was her caretakers. But because of you at home and your willingness to share our story today, a community caretakers and her long lost sister had the opportunity to lay Catherine Shirley to rest. I'm going to put on my robe. With a joyful noise and a praise dance to go along with it, a community and a family said their final goodbyes to a remarkable woman. A fearless woman of God who made it to 99 years and the best way to describe Catherine Shirley, they say she was everything. And no matter what situation she was in, she was always the very nicest, pleasant person. She would truly be missed by a lot of people. Like she just had that calm spirit that just just clear the atmosphere. Those sentiments from her caretakers who over the course of her 30 years at the Life Care Center of Grandview became her family. That is because up until now, no one knew if she had any living relatives. And that's when Markham Harvey turned to Fox 4. And we turn to you in less than a week because of your willingness to share our story. Her half-sister, Sheila Johnson, was found and made it from Los Angeles, California, just in time to lay her sister to rest. I'm just sorry that I missed all the years to be with her, that we could have had some beautiful times together. But I'm here now, and I'm here, here, here in love and in spirit with her. Johnson is full of gratitude, never imagining she'd get this moment with Shirley, who she hadn't seen in four plus decades. And indeed, here she is with one final moment with her long lost sister. From the bottom of my heart, words cannot express how I feel knowing that she was loved, very well taken care of. Amazing things happen when you hope. We hoped and here we are. Shout out to Markham Harvey Funeral Home for making this even possible. Catherine Shirley was buried not too far away from here. And now she, after 99 years, can finally rest.